Wearing the white trunks with green trim and weighs 217 pounds even from Catskill, New York. He is undefeated in three professional bouts, all victories, all knockouts. Ladies and gentlemen, a big hand for Mike Tyson. And his opponent in the blue corner. He's wearing the black trunks with white stripe and weighs 184 and one quarter pounds from Columbus, Ohio. He's also undefeated seven in a row, five by knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, Rick the Ram Spain. Gentlemen, you're fighting the state of New Jersey. There's a three knockdown rule at my discretion. There's a mandatory eight count, there's a standing eight count. When I tell you to break, I want you to protect yourself and step back at all times. The bell only saves you in the last round. Any questions? Yes, sir. Shake hands, come out boxing. Good luck, gentlemen. Mike Tyson's fourth fight. First fight in front of a big time audience, though. This time not in Albany, but in the Atlantic City Resorts International. This man, Ricardo Spain, he's having only his second pro fight. One fight, one win. Mike Tyson, three fights, three wins, two inside a round. And the last one against Don Halpin went all of four rounds. And Tyson, we've already seen in his brief pro career, hits like a steam hammer. As Ricardo Spain has already found out, boy, that was quick. Boy, that was fast. Boy, that was hard. And the ref takes a very clean look at the... Uh, at the eyes, the eyes of the giveaway. Oh, left, left, the legs have gone. This is all over. Yes, it is. I don't believe it. That's, that's well inside a minute. Spain can't believe it. Tyson absolutely destroyed him there. Well, we wondered, didn't we, when we saw the Halpin fight? Can it be just a month ago in May in Albany? Tyson was relaxed, subdued almost, took his time, four rounds this time. Wow, brother. The little combination there, that was the first knockdown. The right hand was the one that finished it. And this young man is signifying evil intent in the heavyweight division. And in front of this audience in Atlantic City, this, I promise you, is going to make one or two really stand and take notice. <laughs> the left hook, the power was astonishing. The legs just went every which way. Four fights, four wins for Mike Tyson. On July 11th, 1985, Tyson had his fifth professional fight against John Alderson. They were both undefeated and had almost identical records. Well, we're ready to get going for fighting here. Mike Tyson, Big John Alderson. Let's meet the officials that will be handling the fight at ringside and meet the combatants with our ring announcer, Michael Buffer. And now, ladies and gentlemen, from the Trump Casino Hotel on the boardwalk in Atlantic City, let's get ready to rumble. This is in the heavyweight division, scheduled for six rounds, and something's got to give. They're both undefeated. The referee for this bout is Frank Cappuccino introducing first in the red corner wearing the red trunks with white trim weighing 226 and one half pounds from Cabin Creek West Virginia his professional record four consecutive victories all by knockout ladies and gentlemen John Alderson and his opponent in the blue corner, wearing the white trunks with red, white, and blue trim, and weighing in at 215 pounds even, from Catskill, New York. His professional record, also four consecutive victories, all by knockout, introducing uh, Mike Tyson. He'll be the popular one tonight as Frank Chappuccino talks to him. I want you to understand one thing. I want a good, clean, hard fight. Any low blows, any thumbing, healing, butting, the holding and hitting will cost you the round. And if I have to go further, I'll do that also. In the event of a knockdown, the man standing go to the farthest neutral corner, stay there until I call him back. Okay? When I say break, I want you to protect yourself at all times, and you step back clean. Both of you understand that. 
with his touch gloves. Good luck. Well, the folks back in West Virginia may not recognize this man without his miner's head. He's come out of the mines to fight. He won May 31st, a second-round knockout over George Mayweather. And his opponent also with a one-round.